Good evening everyone. Today I will be showing you how to automate um, making screenshots on your uh, laptop or PC um, for whatever reason. Hello everyone. My name is Hao Zhong. I'm here to help you to use Office Work tools such as Excel and Power Automate. If you think my videos are helpful, please help me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you. The first thing that you need to do is um, download Power Automate desktop, which is free from Microsoft. All right. Then uh, there's, a, uh, there's a few options on how you can take uh, screenshots. So the first option is um, take screenshot, right? You can app capture all the monitor screens that you have um, attached to um, your computer. So all screens, or you can ask the Power Automate desktop to take screenshot of your primary screen, or you can select screen and then put a number, the, the number of the screen to uh, capture and uh, foreground window means um, the existing um, uh, window that you put in front of uh, Power Automate desktop. You can also save the screenshot to a clipboard or file, right? Um, image file, just put the um, the directory and the name of the file. So I'm just going to demo you a bit. So I will just put this folder and then I will name it as one.jpg uh, image format. I will change it to jpg. I, I click on save. Then I click on maybe run. And then if I go to the window, Explorer, and I double click and see what I got. So yeah, it's because my force ground is Power Automate, so it will show me this. So what you do is actually um, you save, right? You actually, um, maybe if you want to put a weight here in front, all right, maybe with two seconds you save All right then you close then you go back to automate desktop and uh, yeah can you see the screenshot here so you need to run it so i'm going to click on run now i'm going to minimize this window i'll wait for five seconds I think it will take a screenshot. So we'll go back to this window explorer. Here you go. I have the screenshot of the foreground window. The second uh, thing that I want to show you is to uh, take screenshot of UI element. So this is just to Take a screenshot of certain parts of your windows or browser so um, in ui element you can pick uh, the ui element that you want to screenshot so you click on add ui element All right maybe you go to this um, um, web browser um then you select the things that you want to screenshot so maybe uh let's see yeah let's see maybe i want to take a screenshot of um this text right um i will then control left click all right then i Select file again. 
then I put in the the far path. Select uh, JPG, click on save. And we'll just you know disable this text screen and uh, disable this weight as well. Then I am going to run. Okay, I think it's done. I will go to one.jpg and open the file, and here you go exactly the same with this one that I screenshot earlier. Um, the next thing I want to show you is uh, uh, take screenshot of a uh, web page. This one, um, you will need um, Chrome first. All right, launch new instance. URL maybe w.yahoo.com. Right, click on save. Then find the screenshot button. Uh, take screenshot of that page web browser instance browser so you can capture entire web page or specific element so if a ui element do what i have shown you earlier or you can just take the entire web page and then you go to file and then you put in the location of the file click on save i'm going to disable this one then i am going to Run. All right. Okay, I think it's done. So I'm going to go to the JPG. Wow, looks like too many many screenshots. Um, I think that's it. Uh, with what I I wanted to show you, um, uh, please leave a question if you have one in the comment section, uh, specifically on what you want to do. And uh, maybe I can help you by uh, making a video. Um, if you like this video, please uh, give it a like and remember to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.